Why are y'all doing this to me? I'm trying to make dinner for my family. I'm looking at Twitter. Shit's going crazy. My mind is, oh, oh, oh. Is it finally happening? Is it finally? I feel like I'm the Joker right now. Is it finally happening? Holy shit. Things are happening and it is glorious. I know we haven't got an official announcement yet. I'm sitting there walking back and forth because I can't contain myself. But holy shit. I think it's happening. So hopefully, you know, generally the shit I put out there comes true. Let's hope it does. Release the fucking Snyder Cup, baby! What's going on, my DC fans? And welcome back to another episode. And... <laughs> Listen. I know... It's not official yet, okay? But I need to tell you my story, and we need to talk about what's going to happen in a couple hours. Very, very important. Being a part of the Snyder Cup movement, we're always looking for leaks. We're always looking for, for little details, for, you know, like HBO teasers, trying to find little details that could, that could tell us that the, the Snyder Cut is going to be on HBO Max or, or when it's coming. And I mean, we just, like, we have some of the best detectives that I've ever seen. <laughs> trying to figure out, get like get all little details about this movie. I go on Twitter. Usually, when I go home, I put my phone away. I was cooking dinner, so I said, you know what? I'm just going to check my phone while I'm cooking dinner. I go on there, and there is a list of all the movies that are going to be on HBO Max, the debut of HBO Max from Cinema Blend. Okay, you know, whatever, no big deal. I'm probably not going to read that article. Then I am notified that there is no Justice League on that list. So, okay, so sure enough, I click on the Cinema Blend article telling you all the movies that are going to be on HBO Max. There is no Justice League. So, of course, right away, I freak out because I'm like, HBO Max has been teasing a Justice League movie. So, if the, just, if the Joss Whedon Justice League is not on HBO Max, then clearly... It's the Snyder Cut that they were teasing. So I freaked out. And I wrote like a tweet right away like, holy, holy, holy shit. Like, it's happening. It's going down. And I explained to myself saying that Justice League is not on the list, but yet they've been teasing it. What does that mean? That means we are getting the Snyder Cut. Huge deal. But then I did a little, I, did, I, I um, checked a couple other articles, on, um, other websites with a movie list. And some of those um, articles had Justice League on there. But I trust Cinema Blend. I trust Sean O'Connell. So I believed him. But still, I was like, ah, uh, maybe it's not quite true. So I was like, ah, uh, whatever. It's still very exciting. We just don't know. And then a little bit later, I checked Twitter again. And then it was just, boom. Holy crap. Grace Randolph, all of the scoopers are all apologizing. All of the naysayers are coming out of the woodwork saying, it's coming. We're sorry. It's coming. And like I said, Grace Randolph is saying that they were in, they were finalizing the deal as of the other day. Like it was going down on Tuesday or uh, on Monday. It was, they were finalizing the deal. And then she said, expect an announcement during the watch party. And now let's get to the watch party. Zack Snyder is doing an, a Man of Steel watch party in a couple hours. Live stream. You need to watch it. He's going to be, I guess, hosting it on his Vero account. And the word on the street is, is that is where he's going to announce the Snyder Cut. Everyone's saying in all the scoopers, Grace Randolph is more than like 100% sure that it's happening. Like, and you know, she's putting her whole reputation on the line. I don't care what you think about her or whatever, but she's literally saying it's happening. It's happening today. It's, it's going down at this live watch party of Man of Steel. And if you've been following Zach and everything that's been going on is that they were going to have a Man of Steel um, seven year anniversary watch party. But it came early. And so it's like, okay, what's going on? And then you see that uh, Cyborg, Ray Fisher, is going to join in. And then uh, yesterday, Jace Momoa is on Instagram acting up again, saying, release the fucking Snyder Cut. Like, it is such a great time right now. It's exciting. It, it, it's happening. It, it is freaking happening. Now, it hasn't been officially announced yet. And I told you guys. I said, when it gets announced, I am going to release a video. So if it gets announced today, there is going to be another video on my channel, pretty much of just me freaking out. Who knows what's going to happen? But I'm looking forward to Mick Minus. 
he's going to break the Justice League DVD in half. I think someone else said they were going to burn the DVD. I'm looking forward to all this. I'm looking forward to, to everyone. It's such a celebration right now. Almost three years of hard work, of the money put forth, all the campaigns, all the tweeting, the hashtagging, and this is what it comes down to. Okay, this is what it comes down to. But with me saying that, this ride isn't over. I know a bunch of people are like, oh my God, it's over. It's kind of sad. Uh, but it's not over. It's not. Unless Zach comes out today and says that I'm coming back to finish my Snyder Cut, or I'm coming back to finish my five movie arc, and we're getting the air cut, then I can be like, oh, okay, we're done. We did it then. <laughs> then we can let off the pedal because it's a done deal. I already think that that's happening. I already think it's in the works. But guys, huge, huge week. I mean, it, it's it's pandemonium, and I cannot wait to watch the Man of Steel live commentary with Zack Snyder. It's going to be f so freaking fantastic. And he has a, he's having a Q and A afterwards. And do not miss it. Please do not miss it. It's going to be um, 8 a.m. Pacific time, I believe. Uh, on his Vero account, and of course, it's it's gonna someone's probably gonna tape it and put it on YouTube later on, or it might be uh, live streaming on YouTube as well. I don't know, but yes, if you don't have a Vero, this is the time. Maybe they'll be doing it on Twitter too. I'm not 100% sure, but yes, t today's a huge day. If you're a Snyder Cut fan and you you've wanted this movie to come out for, like I said, going on three years now, this is this is our moment. So live it up. It's great. It feels amazing. Not 100% yet, though. Not 100%. I'm very excited, but we have not got an official announcement. We and we we know how this this works. But when you have all the scoopers and you have Grace Randolph, literally everyone saying that it's happening, it's a done deal. Then what are you supposed to do? You're supposed to celebrate. Okay. Again, this is our time. You have to watch the Man of Steel watch party. I'll be there. Everyone will be there, and it wouldn't surprise me, honestly. If Henry Cavill was there and the whole cast and crew, you know, Jason Momoa, Gal Gadot, all those, the whole Justice League was there in the whatever, however they're going to do with the live commentary. That would be mind-blowing because Henry hasn't said a word about the Snyder Cut, about releasing it. He was the only one that didn't hashtag it. Minus Ezra Miller, but he doesn't have social media. So if Henry shows up, it, it's, it's going to be glorious, guys. So again, take it all in. Very exciting stuff. And with that said... That's the video, and thanks for watching, and please subscribe, because that helps me in return. I can help you, and don't forget, every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, new content's coming to you from Subject Reviews, and also, live stream coming in Friday, talk about all this shit that happened this week, so do not forget to stop on by at 12.45 p.m. Eastern Time. I'll remind you on Friday's video in the morning as well. So, that being said, I'm out. And you know this, man!